Hello everybody, welcome back to today's video. Today we are checking out Skit's Prison. Thank you to whoever invited me to come review this. I do apologize for the long wait. Our current list is quite long. Anyway, let's just get straight into it. So, when I join, I get a book that pops up on my screen. Walk forward, throw the A mine to break blocks and sell them to get, uh, sell them to Simon. You can upgrade your pickaxe, you have an extra space in front of the U. Uh, purchase keys and items with Slack Token Shop. Alternative ranking. Alright, so that's kind of like a little bit of a tutorial when you join the game. That's pretty cool. I had random blocks sitting here, but I do, I would recommend putting on the jumpsuit automatically for players when they first join the server. Uh, this is your bus system. I do like how you have your bus system, so I'm kind of in prison. The only thing I would recommend doing with this is maybe making it so you have a few guards out here or something. Just to make it a little bit more is a prison feeling type thing. Um, alright, and get rid of those, uh, word guard messages saying you can't use this here and you can't break this here because I'm guessing if I break that, yeah. So you can disable that with a region flag, I believe. Uh, so make sure to look into that. Anyway, welcome to the Skits Prison. You have arrived into fresh A block. Please read the manual and science here. I'm to recommended, uh, 1.12.2. Sadly, I'm on 1.8 because I have, was recording about four videos before this, so I do apologize if anything I missed in here is not on 1.12. Um, you do have a nice type of server in terms of players, so keep up the good work with all the players on your server. Um, that's very, very much, uh, a good idea to do, because if you have a player base, you can expand that over time and then those players will probably stick with you. So that's pretty cool. Anyway, uh, basic rules, treat others with respect. I guess if I do slack rules, I'll see the same thing. Yes, I will. Um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, useful info, we use the bus system. Take the bus to the canteen for free reaction, so you get free food there. Sign up for the website. Sign. I. It says signs URL there. Um, I'm not exactly sure if there's a way you could just get it so it just is like a button that says click or something. Uh, maybe that's the plugin you're using, I'm not exactly sure. Uh, prison explained, I know what prison is. For mine's A4 through A1, right to the tree farm, so that's your tree farm. Kitchen, buy food here. Maybe make it so, uh, you don't have like this little waiting line, because that is, it is nice to have that. Um, also make it so you can't sell food. I don't see a reason why you would need to sell food in prison, especially to the person giving you food, the chef. So I just look into doing that. Uh, head chef, accept quest, getting coal. I'm not going to accept that quest right now. The same thing I would recommend. I saw this quest plugin on another server a few weeks ago. I'd really recommend making it so it gives you a timer or something on the screen that tells you how long until the quest, um, like, uh, option goes away. Uh, so that's just my suggestion. Anyway, cells AS, mine ahead, red equals green equals safe. So red's PVP, green is safe. So I guess I can mine over here. No, I can't mine over here. So those are the cells. So I'm guessing these are like player cells. Yeah, they're rented. So you can put stuff inside of your player cells. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, so that's kind of traditional prison. I haven't seen that in quite a long time. So great job keeping with the traditional type prison stuff. Enchanting tables, unlock B. In terms of your tab list, you do have a little glitch. Maybe that's just because players are joining and leaving at the same time there. Uh, but rank names show up, which is great. You don't have any extra spaces or anything, and it does show your player count. Very nice and clean. In terms of your scoreboard, um... I'm just gonna go to eight. Okay, little glitch. Little glitch when I'm walking on... Can I jump down there, or am I not allowed to jump down there for some reason? I don't know. Um... So, okay, do not log off when in a mine. Maybe you can set an automatic setting for that. So if they do log off, you automatically teleport out or something just to prevent errors because people will still log out regardless of if you say don't log out, people will still log out. Uh, so I would get rid of, in terms of scoreboard, I would put the date a little bit smaller. I don't think you need it bold and in the middle. Uh, you don't need your username. Everybody knows their username, but I would put your rank name or something there. So if you don't have a rank, you just put rank or member or something. That gets it a little bit easier. Um, in terms of the vote party, that's always good to have on there. IP is always good to have on there. T the name's always good to have on there as well. So keep up the good work with that. So this is like traditional prison, not OP, it seems. Um, in terms of shops and stuff, I'm guessing... You can't use this command, do shop ID. So maybe make it so if you're just typing slash shop, you don't have that unless you know. Because um, you can see there's a, there's a shop here, but there's not a shop in, um, obviously, in with slash shop. So I would recommend just disabling slash shop and making it so it tells you to go to the him inside of, outside of every mine or whatever. I think that would work in pr it pretty well. Um... This is a pretty interesting prison. I mean, it's just, it, rather than the mines being in the ground, you do do the unique type of uh, prison where it's not actually in the ground, it's actually the wall. So you're actually mining through the wall. So that's pretty cool. I do like how you've done that. So keep up the good work with that. Um, I think that will work out really, really well. Uh, mine A4 off ahead. So this is the PvP iron mine. 
uh, PvP is enabled in here. This mine isn't for money making. Use the A1, A4 for that. So that's just the PvP mine. A4 mine is that one. Can I go down here? Am I just like not allowed? You must rank up to access this mine. So this message, the rank up message, I would highly recommend making um, a making it like um, red or something to see because without that you can't really see sell it. Um, okay, so you can guess mine flowers or do you just can you not? You can just take these flowers apparently. Okay, so you can literally just stand here and sell these. $30 for the flowers on destroy from here? So I could just sit here and destroy flowers and get more money than I did mining for like the last five minutes? Oh, that's insane. Okay, so obviously flowers is the place to go if you want money. But I'm guessing they take a lot of regen. So keep up the good work with those custom type of like selling things and custom like um, stuff like that because that works. Ow. That works out well. Maybe make that platform a little bigger as well. But overall, it seems like you have it really, really well set up. So I would advise just keep working on it because as long as you keep expanding your server and stuff, I think you'll have a lot of success for it. Uh, make sure to do competitions and stuff. You have a nice uh, group of mods and helpers and uh, ranks and stuff. So keep up that good work because the more you have of that, the better the team gets and the more info you get and everything and more players. So keep up the great work with that. I think you'll have a lot of success with this. Um, my arms can't handle this guy's a quest guy, so you got quests and everything. All right, so you're just typical prison server. Pretty interesting indeed. Um, I'm not going to go into that much detail or anything about any of this. I guess I'll click yet. Can I just click yes? There's no, like, way to confirm that I accepted a quest. So that would, the quest system would be something I would for sure work on um, because it says canceled right there, and I can't actually click it. Um, I need $10,000 to rank up. So I have to, I'm typing, can I just type yes? Okay, I have to type yes. So that would be, that would be something to really make sure you look into because clearly I wasn't able to accept that request unless I typed yes. Um, so I would highly recommend checking into that if possible to make sure you have a quest system that actually is realistic and works pretty well for your server. So I would look into that especially um, for newer players because newer players will want to do quests to get ranking up quickly um, and that is for sure some way to look into it to figure out how it works. But overall it still looks like it's going to be a very if you keep working on it. Um, so I'm just going to do this quest real quickly um, and then I'll end this video today. If you would like to do a re-review or anything, please let me know on Discord. If you want to server review yourself, please also let me know on Discord. Um, it, the link is down in the description. Just type uh, discord or bjgdevelopment.com slash discord and it will take you to our Discord page. In that page, you can um, type server review and the bot will tell you every single thing you want to do for the server. So make sure to go check that out if you haven't already. All right, let's go ahead and sell this to the guy and we will go ahead and end today's video. So give it to you. Completed, delivered that quest. Very nice. I'm going to deliver you and deliver you. I got books, prison blocks, prison manual. So this is just... Uh, how to do everything, rank up, pretty cool, prison blocks, all the blocks you can do, black markets, very cool. Anyway, looks like a great server, keep working on it. Um, I would expand more stuff like you do with the flowers, spread around hub, do treasure hunts and stuff. I think it will work out quite well. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Thank you for also um, going ahead and asking us for a review. Very much appreciated. I will see you in tomorrow's video. Make sure you subscribe if you're new here, and I'll see you next